Hi everyone, it's Trina here. Happy, happy Easter. I hope you're uh, not eating too many chocolate eggs. Um, I've got some Easter crafts for us to have a go at today. Uh, this one is marbling paper, um, so it gives a really, really pretty effect. And when you're done, you can use it to cut out Easter shapes, uh, make bunting, stick it on um, Easter cards, loads of stuff. So what you'll need from this for this is a tray or a plate. I've just borrowed one from the art room. Some shaving foam. Make sure it's foam, not gel, because it doesn't work so well with gel. Um, a piece of white paper or card, or several pieces of white paper and card if you want to make a few pieces. Um, and then just a load of different coloured food colouring. And something to give the food colouring a stir it with. So I'm using the end of a paintbrush, but I'll show you that when we do it. Okay, let's get going. So the first thing we need to do is give our shaving foam a good shave. And then, I'm going to see if it enough. And then pour a wedge. Enough. And then take our food colour in and just carefully put some drops in. Blue. paper and just plunk it on top let it rest for a little bit The 
pattern will have formed on the paper. And it's as easy as that. So you can wipe off the excess shaving foam with some kitchen roll or something like that. And then these are the results you've got. Um, quite nice patterns. Um, so then, like I said earlier, you can use it to make various different things. So I've drawn around an egg template here and I've cut that out. And I think I've used it. I do quite a few of these and then you can use it for bunting. That's why I have. Make it all nice and cheerful. a nice bit of the pattern that you like.